everyone, and welcome to week 16 of English 120. This week, please begin by watching the lecture. You're going to be reading the Log of the Snark, pages 327 to 374, and you're going to complete the journal entry that's posted um, under this week's content. Uh, please revise your research paper based on our conferences. If you haven't yet had a conference, you can still do a makeup conference this week, but after this week, you will not be able to make, make up your conference. Uh, please participate in the peer review workshop by uploading your revised draft by Wednesday and responding to your peers draft by Sunday. And please make sure you pay attention to the directions so that you do it right. So this week, um, the questions that we have on uh, the log of the snark, we're almost getting to the end of the log of the snark. Jack and Charmian are going on a blackbirding exposition. Please make sure you look up the history of blackbirding um, and let me know how it has affected the people of the Solomon Islands. Um, what do Jack and Charmian do um, aboard the, Mino Mino the Minota? This is the blackbirding ship they go on. And what happened to Captain Mackenzie, the former captain? Then I'd like you to look up uh, the history of one of the places they travel to on the Minota and that is the Langa Langham Lagoon. It's a really interesting history. Um, what happens during their final lap on the Minota, so the final part of the journey? How do Jack and Charmian escape? And then how does Charmian describe the experience in a letter home? Um, you're gonna be using evidence and all of your answers from both the Log of the Snark and from outside sources. Uh, what is a naturalist among the headhunters? And what if, so what about, what is a natural surround the, the headhunters? And about who, how do Jack and Charmian feel about meeting its author? How does Woodford approach studying the people of Solomon Islands? Um, Woodford is the author of A Naturalist Among the Headhunters. This is a book that you'll need to look up. And last but not least, why does Wada leave the crew? What animals do they end up with on the snark during this part of the journey? And how does the crew's ill health affect their ability to navigate the ship? How does Jack feel about Charmian's happy-hearted mood, even as things get really grim on the snark? Post your answers by, by um, uh, actually by Sunday at 11.59 p.m. All right, so we're in the final phase of your research project. This week, you're gonna be doing a peer review. I've dropped the self-review. Um, you can't do a peer review unless you've already done a conference. So please do not sign up to do peer review unless you've competed, completed the conferences. You may have a conference with me uh, during my office hours tomorrow, from, that's Tuesday from 11 to 12.30 or 1.30 to 3.30, 1.30 to 3. Or we can set up a different time. Um, I have slots on Wednesday, um, but remember you'll be losing points if you do not set up this conference. Um, next week, your final draft will be due of your research paper. So here's how the peer review workshop works. Um, you're gonna upload your completed eight to 10 page paper here by Wednesday at 11.59 p.m. When you upload your paper, please include your name, your email address, and any direct questions you have for your reviewer. Once you have uploaded your own paper, choose one of your peers that has already uploaded a paper and respond to that peer to say that you will provide a peer review. You may not choose a peer that has already been chosen for a peer review. So everyone gets one peer review. Once completed, you're gonna upload the form under the peer review assignment. Please also upload a copy of the review to your peer. All right, guys, that's it um, for, this, for this week. If you have questions, as always, please read